Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. Sincerely, Jacqueline DIY. Today I'm super excited to share with you some Easter decor items. I absolutely love it. It is a very important holiday for me, my family as Christians, but I also love Easter home decor items. So today I'm gonna share with you some using Dollar Tree and Dollar Store items, so keep watching. So for the first decor item that we're making, we're making this bunny home sign and what you're gonna need is this home sign and if you go to the Dollar Tree you're gonna find that the home sign comes with um, the sign on top I'll link it to show you what the original sign looks like and you're gonna need a bunny wood sculpture some of the footage got cut off but then after I found these beads at the Dollar Tree and they're so cute aren't they and basically I strung the beads and then tied it around my bunny's neck. So the next thing I did is because there were these little holes at the top of the bunny, because the bunny had um, like string there so you can hang it, I just kind of filled it with some filler that I had. So the issue was the bunny was a little bit heavier once it got glued to the sign. So I needed a way to keep the bunny up. Now you can do this multiple ways, but I actually had an old frame and I decided to glue the stand to the back of the bunny. You can leave your bunny like this, but again, I didn't really like the neutral um, color popping out, so I decided to use this chalk paint to paint around the letters. Now, I'm just gonna warn you, this is gonna be a bit tedious, but I think that the, the actual complete uh, look looked a lot better. Okay, to give this sign a little bit more character, I decided to add some wooden letters and I just spelled out happy. I then used the same paint color that I used for the lettering to use on my wooden letters. And here is the final product. I absolutely love this sign. I think it's very, very cute. It's minimalistic, but it's also fun. Let me know what you think below. So the next DIY is this these beautiful napkin holders, and I'm just using some shower curtain um, hangers, the plastic ones from the Dollar Tree, and these garland carrots. and then this really pretty twine string. 
So what you're gonna do is wrap the twine around your shower curtain hanger. Now there's two types of the Dollar Tree, you want the plastic ones. What you're gonna do is grab one of the carrots, you wanna cut them off of the garland and you wanna apply some hot glue or some E6000 to your ring and you wanna glue it on. If you use E6000, you do have to tape it down just so it can dry, so probably hot glue would be better for this. show you another napkin holder and this is using the same beads that we used for the previous project and basically what you're gonna do is just string them onto the twine and tie them the next DIY is I'm going to be making a cute trinket holder and it is just using this Dollar Tree container and this Dollar Tree bunny. And it's pretty easy, guys. What we're gonna do is just glue the bunny onto the top of the lid. For the next DIY, we are going to be making a centerpiece and I had this ceramic container already from home and I'm just using some Dollar Tree flowers and some a mixture of Michael's florals, but a majority of them are from the Dollar Tree to make this very simple cost-effective centerpiece using faux flowers. cover up the foam in the base, I just use some moss. results. I think the tablescape came out really well and all the DIYs are being shown here. I hope that you got some amazing ideas from this DIY video. If you like what you see, please hit the like button, subscribe, comment below which one was your favorite DIY, and I'll see you at my next video. Thank you!